Hey, what's up guys? It's me, the Black Gamer God, and I'm here to give you my quick little review of the Koshin Each Pro Gaming headset. This is their G2000 model. I've had this for a few weeks now, and I'm happy to say I really, really love this headset, and I'm going to tell you why. But first, let's talk a little bit about the features of this headset, including the unboxing and the packaging. So here you can see uh, the box art. It looks really, really nice, really cool. It includes the headset, the operating instruction manual, as as well as the double plug connector. For some reason, the box art features the headset as orange instead of blue. Um, I don't know if they have an orange model out there, but my headset is in fact blue. So maybe they was just cheap on the box art, I don't know. What really drew me to this headset was the LED lights. I love blue and I don't know, the lights just seem like it just seemed like something I really, really wanted. I love bright, shiny things, I guess. <laughs> so I purchased this on eBay. It cost me around $20. And so, yeah, let's talk about this headset now. Um, this headset is a large, lightweight DJ style headphones with a high sensitivity microphone. It has a very, very comfortable soft earmuff design. When I tell you this is so freaking comfortable, like, a lot of the times I forget I'm wearing this thing because it fits around your ear. It's not pressing into your ear, but it fits snugly on your ears. Um, the earmuffs themselves are not noise canceling. You will be able to hear your environment around you. I don't really look for anything that's too, too noise canceling, so I'm perfectly fine with that. But if you are, this is not the headset for you. It also features a wide, soft padded, adjustable headband. The headband is made of a durable, strong plastic at the top and it is underlaid with a soft gel-like padding. Um, this headband really contours to your head. It's not too, too tight, it's not too snug, but it's not too slack or loose either. Um, so it's just really, really well made in that aspect. Now the, the adjustable sliders, they do feel a bit on the cheap side. So as long as you're not too, too rough with how you're handling this headset and, and adjusting the, uh, the earmuffs, it should hold up and last you quite a minute, but I could see someone just being excessively like mishandling it and it not holding up that well. So just be mindful of that. Um, this headset is equipped with a thick, durable, fabric coated wiring. Um, I find that I prefer this over the traditional, you know, plasticky wiring because it tends to hold up a bit better. Um, a lot of times you tend to get a lot of shortages with those cordings. Um, and along this cord, it is six feet, I believe, in length. So you get a lot of length to work with, whether you are playing on your controller or playing on your PC. Um, this wiring is also equipped with a remote for easy, quick volume control and mic on and off switch, which is just really, really, really convenient. Now, keep in mind the volume control controls the volume of the audio as well as the volume of your microphone. So you have to make sure that you have both of those balanced really, really well if you are going to adjust them because it's going to affect both. Um, this headset features a double plug input jack. One is for the headset and the other is for the microphone. Um, the connector allows you to join the two uh, jacks into one if you have um, a situation like for your PS4 where it plugs into your controller. It works perfectly fine with that. I tried to use, um, I tried to split it up and connect the ears to my TV and the microphone to my controller on my PS4. It didn't work that way. You have to conjoin them together and connect them in into your PS4 controller in order for it to completely work. Now, if you have a PC, you can definitely um, split the audio and the microphone on your PC, which is, I guess, what this is intended for. So that's perfect. You don't have to go and get a connector or a splitter. They have it equipped for you, which is really, really convenient. I appreciated that. Um, also, you will see that this plug has a USB connector. This is for the blue LED glow light design. This is what powers it. This will not, you cannot use your headset with just the USB. It is specifically for the lights, okay? So you have to have your plug jacks plugged into somewhere. Um, the USB is not going to allow you to use your headset or your mic, okay? Um, and the last part, I guess, is just the sound quality. Um, for $20, um, this is a very decent headset. Um, I feel like the microphone is very receptive. It's very clear. 
um, a lot of the times you can hear everything that I'm saying um, with clarity and in some of my uh, streams, I've noticed you can actually hear me breathing super, super hard. Um, so it's very receptive in that aspect. And I do appreciate that because sometimes you get headsets and it doesn't really pick up the sounds that well. But this does really well. Now, the microphone itself only adjusts in one direction. It rests up and you can bring it down in front of your mouth. It doesn't adjust sideways. It's just where it is. And it's perfectly fine because it gets the job done. It picks up what you're saying really well. So outside of that, I don't really have any complaints with that. Um, now, as far as the audio goes with the earmuffs, I'm not too big on, you know, analyzing sound or whatever, but it's a decent headset. You get good quality sound out of this headset. I don't really have any complaints. I think you get a decent blend of treble, mid, and bass. If you're looking for your headphones to have a lot of bass, this is lacking on the bass side. I don't really care that much about it, but you can definitely hear everything in your game with these headsets, including footsteps, like on Call of Duty, or um, even when I was playing Alien Isolation, I heard that monster coming a mile away. So yeah, you literally hear everything with this headset. So I really like it. Um, I really, really enjoyed this headset. It, it's, it's changed my whole gaming experience. This is the first... Um, double eared headset that I've purchased I have another one um, that I was using before and it just wasn't allowing me to hear the game and do my uh, my voice chat my voiceovers so I invested in this and I'm very very glad that I did this whole review is being recorded off of the headset itself so you can just see how clear and nice the audio quality is the microphone and everything so Thank you all so much for checking out my review. If you liked this, if you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, go ahead and check out my channel. If you like what you see, go and subscribe. Uh, we have a lot more coming in the future. Thank you all so much for watching, and I will see y'all later in the next video. Until then, be blessed, guys. Bye.